When we first moved here in 95, there was groups of these purple flowers all over, um, just along the creek. There would be a patch as big as the house. It was just kind of a dead spot too, like nothing else grew there. They took over, there was no, you know, your crested wheatgrass, your brome grasses, none of that stuff was growing there because the weeds all just took over. It's something you have to keep on top of, otherwise it's going to be even a bigger problem. A pretty good working definition of a noxious weed is that if it's allowed to grow unchecked, it's going to have an adverse effect on the ecology and the economy of an area. Uh, there are ranches in the Missoula Valley that can't raise cows anymore. They don't have grass. The next highest and best use for that land is subdivisions and housing. One of my jobs is to meet with those people that move here and say, hey, you don't know this, but you got weeds here, here, and here, and if you don't want to, these are the people that you need to contact to that could take care of it for you. Right now, the biggest battle on the Blackfeet Reservation is the spotted knapweed. I've talked with a couple of producers that, you know, at one point didn't really care. When your 40 acres of beautiful alfalfa crop is filled with noxious weeds, you're going to remember me. What did she say how to do effective noxious weed management? What we want to do is send everybody that came here wanting insects, we want to send insects back with them. It's a relatively slow process. You're going to start to see this big uh, oval shape and you've got a hole in the spurge where they've really um, done a number on that spurge. And boy, when you see one, you, you just go, wow. And that tells you that they're starting to work. When I tell people I work on biological control of weeds, they usually say, what? And I say, well, I use bugs to hopefully control noxious weeds. I'm working with the Tansy Ragwort flea beetle. Tansy Ragwort is pretty much a uh, new invader to Montana. It is toxic to cattle, causing liver damage. Education is an important part of it. Tansy Ragwort is a unfamiliar weed with most Montanans. 